Welcome. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can add texture effects in DaVinci Resolve. So first of all, go ahead and choose any texture. If you already have a texture, go ahead and import that to DaVinci Resolve. And if you don't have it, go over to Google or any website and you can find different textures. So right now for this video, I'm using this one. So just simply go ahead and download this. So make sure that you import your texture over here. And now let's go ahead and create a new Fusion composition. So let's go ahead and rename this as Texture Effect. So I just simply created a Fusion composition. Now let's go ahead and double click this. So here we are in the Fusion composition. All right, so the first thing that you need to do is go ahead and drag a background over here. And let's go ahead and add a merge as well. Connect the two and then connect it with media out. And the reason why I'm using this background is because right now, if we drag in our texture and then we go ahead and connect it with this merge, you will see that this appears shorter than our original size of the clip. So make sure that you already know the size of your clip. And in order to resize this texture, all you need to do is just First of all, drag first of all, create a background and then drag your texture on your background. So this is how I did it. So let's just go ahead and select this merge tool where this texture is added and go ahead and increase the size of this so that it fits your screen. Otherwise, if you won't add this background, this will not increase the size according to the original size of our video. So just make sure that you know the size of your video. And of course, you can go ahead and leave it at default. But this is the way that I'm doing it. Now that we have our texture added and resized to fit our size of the clip or size of our video, just go over to Merge to once again. And then in your Blend section, just go ahead and type in 0.2. Now this will decrease the opacity of our texture as you can see so that this looks like it is in the background. And now what we're going to do is we are going to animate this. So at zero in our merge tool, go ahead and create a keyframe right here in the flip section. Now go over at 10 in this timeline and then hit this horizontal flip. And here you can see we have this horizontal flip and then go over to 20 and then click this vertical flip. So here you can see it flips once again. And now let's go over at 30 and click this vertical flip once again. So right now we have our texture animated and here you can see this is how it is animating. But we don't want to go ahead and animate this again and again frame by frame. So in order to automate this process, go ahead in spline, click over here in spline, and then select your merge tool where this flip horizontal and flip vertical are available. And then go ahead and select this so that you see all of your keyframes. Okay, so select all your keyframes. And over here, you will see that we have an option of set loop. So just go ahead and click this. And this will allow you to set a loop so that all these keyframes will go ahead and keep on looping once they are over. So let's go ahead and see how this looks. So there you have it. We have an animating texture background in DaVinci Resolve. And of course, you can go ahead in your timeline, drag this texture effect over here. And this will be, you can add any clip over it, or this can work as an overlay as well. So you can try out many things with it, but this is the basic thing that you can do. You can simply create a texture background effect in Fusion, and then you can use it in your main timeline. And of course, if you think that this is a little too fast, you can go ahead and change the keyframes a bit. You can move the keyframes forward so that it fits 
according to the kind of texture effect that you need for your video. So I hope you liked the video and I'll see you in the next one.